So a couple of threes already for Zaragoza. Jakob Tuma to Pruitt. Omar Pruitt, and he answers. Wow. This was Pruitt. This is like a free throw for him. He, is, uh, he does make the second one rather, so he goes one for two. And it's now with six points. Three-point shot, and Dalton! Rubon dribbles it off his foot, but it goes to Dalton. Now Pruitt, or Rubon, hits the three. Hands it off to Pruitt. Nimberg putting it up, and look at that. Brasino called for the foul on Pruitt. An outcome, or predict an outcome. And this would worry Hernandez. Yes, he is missing a few players tonight, but still. And his team is getting blown out of a player like San Miguel, who really gets into an opponent uh, with his defense. Brasino, meanwhile, misses another easy one down low. It gives uh, Benzing a chance, and finally, he's able to hit a shot. It looked like he was about a meter behind. And Nimberg, who trailed who led by 20, now are on top by just 12. Ennis, meanwhile, goes in and is swatted by Zimmerman. Omar Pruitt drives in. Oh, boy, what a tough finish. Zaragoza would like to force some turnovers and get some points in transition if they can. Dalton, turnaround jumper, good! So 17 points. The advantage, Barreto from behind the arc, and he is hit by Rubon. Paliza steps back, now gets it to Benda. Shot clock down to four. And Chris launches the three and hits it right at the end of the shot clock. I think more than anything right now, Hernandez would just like to see his players get some execution. And Brasino comes out. Okay, so they reset it to 14 seconds on the shot clock. Now Dalton goes in and tries to dunk it on Hustiz. And not on that one. And Barreto drives in. Not there. Hustiz there for the uh, rebound and put back. By as many as 20 points in the first half. Even though they led by 10, they came back and turned on the style again against Casa de Monte.